welcome to today's video. My name is Sonia and I will be working on my 1986 Toyota Corolla A86. <laughs> So for today's shenanigans, I'm going to be installing a harness bar and a racing harness into the car. But before we get into that, I installed the other over fender, the right side, yesterday. If you guys want to see it, there it is. The side was a lot easier. I had no idea what I was doing the first time around, so that was kind of tricky and a bit of a mess. but. This one's a lot better. The alignment is a lot better. Not much of a gap here. This aligned pretty nicely. Uh, the only issue was I wasn't able to open this guy. So I had to dremel this down a little bit. And also, ugh, my cutting skills. I messed up right here. I'm so ashamed. I want to kick myself every time I see that, but it's okay. It's not that... Okay, it's pretty noticeable. But... Here's what it is. But overall, it looks good. I'm actually pretty happy about it. Okay, let's get to work, shall we? Universal bar in black. I really hope it fits. The only thing it doesn't come with is instructions, but I think it should be pretty easy to put in. Looks like somebody already took the seatbelt apart because all the washers are missing. And the spacer. I think it's missing one spacer. And then this, this one is already loose. So, okay, well. Pretty straightforward then. too bad not bad at all pretty sturdy fit nicely win-win also i never showed you guys my back seats um they don't exist there are no back seats the previous owner did a back seat delete and i really love this thing it's by techno toy tuning we even have like the little 86 logo on the panels it's a bit scratched up because I had to put some of the body panels in the back seat whenever I first got the car. As for my harness, I picked up some Corpo harnesses. No, they're not the green Takata ones. I want those too, but no one had them available. So I just went for the next, I went for what is available. And these aren't bad. These weren't all that expensive. But, ooh, these are heavy. They come with their own fancy bag. Let's go ha. I got a 
got them in black. They're four point harness. Should be nice. I got them in black because I feel like any other color will get dirty and it'll look nasty eventually. So I didn't think about what to do with the seatbelt sets there. I totally forgot about this. Um, hmm. I think what I'm gonna do is I still have the old seatbelt in because I don't wanna take apart the panels. The old seatbelt is still here. I was just gonna zip, roll it up and zip tie it to the side. But what I think I can do is maybe put this under the seat and then hook it up to the seat belt. So that way I don't have to worry about it. I hope that works. I think I'm gonna mount these ends to random holes in the back here, just cause these screws actually fit and they're in a pretty good spot too. So that kind of worked out. I thought the black would match my interior, but it looks like my seat's really faded. So, so much for that. That's all right. I am so snug within the seat. I am not going anywhere. That's a wrap for today's video. Thank you guys so much for being here. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.